New York City is home to some of the finest specimens on Earth. In Central Park, the specimens mush together to live in a way that no other animals do on Earth. Various birds, ducks, geese, and even fish live in New York. But the animal who makes its home in every green patch of New York's five boroughs is the squirrel. Specifically, the American red squirrel, or in Latin, Tamiascurius hudsinicus, although the eastern gray squirrel is also fairly common. With their delicate yet complicated claws, have much dexterity that isn't found in other rodents. The squirrel's paws almost appear almost like miniature hands. This is most clearly evident when the squirrel is afraid. It will stand on its hind legs, keep perfectly still, and curl its hands protectively on its chest. The most obvious trait of squirrels is the gathering and burying of nuts for the winter. Squirrels have excellent memories, and nearly always find the nuts come spring. Squirrels cannot digest cellulose, and, contrary to popular belief, squirrels are not herbivores, but omnivores. Late spring is a hard time for squirrels, because many of the nuts and seeds they buried have begun to sprout. At this time of year, one can find squirrels eating the buds off trees, fruit, fungi, and even frogs, and small mammals and birds. The largest problem for a squirrel in the city is electrical wires. The squirrel will enter the transformer, or capacitators, looking for food, and then be electrocuted. This is often the cause for power outages in cities. Squirrels are a special rodent. They range in description as a pest, a cute animal, or even a pet. Certainly, they have learned to coexist with humans almost flawlessly. If nothing else, the squirrel will always be ready to adapt to the changing world much better than any human.